Welcome to SugarSync. Today we're going to talk about the initial setup of SugarSync on your computer. To use SugarSync, it's important that you install the SugarSync Manager application on the computers that you want to synchronize to SugarSync. The desktop application works for both PCs and Macs. Once you have downloaded the application, open the file and follow the instructions to install the application. Once the application is installed, log in to begin the setup process. Give your computer a name that will make it easy for you to recognize and pick an icon to represent your computer. Next, you'll pick the folders on your computer that you want to synchronize. You can use Express Mode to pick the main folders on your computer. Advanced Mode gives you more options to pick any set of folders on your computer. I'll use Express Mode. It will have my main folders already selected. This includes my desktop folder, my documents, my pictures, and I'm also going to add my music. In a separate tutorial, we'll show you how you can stream your music from SugarSync to any other computer and mobile devices like the iPhone. The first time that you synchronize your files, it might take a while depending on how much data will be uploaded to SugarSync. Once the initial set of files are uploaded, the ongoing synchronization will be very fast since SugarSync will upload and download only the new changes to your files. The system tray icon will show you when files are being synchronized to SugarSync. You'll see arrows on the icon when the application is uploading or downloading files. You can click on the icon to view the status of the synchronization. Here we see my initial set of files are being uploaded to SugarSync. Once the synchronization is complete, the system tray icon will show the hummingbird. You can always add more folders in the future by going to the Manage Sync Folders dialog. Here, you'll see the folders that you previously selected, and you can click the button to add more folders. You may have noticed the folder called Magic Briefcase. The Magic Briefcase is a special folder that SugarSync automatically creates on your computer for quick and easy synchronization. Just drag files into your Magic Briefcase folder and the files will immediately be synchronized to SugarSync. And if you install SugarSync on another computer, all of the files in your Magic Briefcase will automatically synchronize to your other computer. Now, let's see SugarSync in action. I'm going to create a new Word document called Sync Notes, and I'll save it to my desktop folder, which is synchronized to SugarSync. When I save the file, SugarSync immediately detects the change and uploads a copy of the new file to SugarSync. The upload takes only a few seconds and that's it. The document is safe and secure in my SugarSync account. If I navigate to the file using Windows Explorer, I'll see a green icon with a check mark on the file. This lets me know that the document has been synchronized to SugarSync. Using SugarSync, you can access all of your data from any computer by visiting the SugarSync website. The system tray icon has a shortcut to get there. Here we see my work laptop, and I can click on the desktop folder. The new file, Sync Notes, is shown since it was automatically synchronized. This website is very convenient. You can download files, view, edit, and even share files and folders with others for easy collaboration. You can also access your files using one of the SugarSync mobile applications. SugarSync has apps for the iPhone, iPad, Android, BlackBerry, Windows Mobile, and Symbian devices. You'll have full access to your files directly from your fingertips. Using SugarSync, you'll have anytime, anywhere access to all of your data. And that concludes the initial setup video. We hope this helps get you started, and we'll see you next time.